Welcome to the tutorial on decoders with enable input. When we make use of decoders with enable inputs, the enable inputs are useful in cascading the decoders to increase their input and the output lines. These are also used to obtain all the outputs to be at 0 or 1 respectively. So here is a truth table corresponding to twist to 4 decoder with the output marked as D0 to D3 and inputs are A and B. So in this particular schematic we have enable input for active high device that means when the enable is equal to 1 then the output will be high when the enable is equal to 0 irrespective of the type of the input that you give the output will be all zeros the logic circuit is also shown which shows E is equal to 1 so the expression for D0, D1, D2 and D3 consists of the enable input pin which is equal to 1. In the second case we make use of a is to 4 decoder again but here we are trying to indicate the enable input for an active low device so you can see that in the truth table we have enable input to be equal to 1 and irrespective of the type of the input that you give the output will be all ones whereas when the enable pin is 0 depending upon the type of the input that is given the output will be corresponding bit will be equal to logic 0. So that is why in the decoder diagram what I need to do is since it is an active low device I need to bubble the output so you can see that in the decoder schematic you, the output is bubbled and in the logic diagram I am going to give the enable input with E is equal to 0 or I can use the NOT gate so when I write the expressions for the outputs that is D0, D1, D2 and D3 I need to mention the enable pin. To construct a 3 is to 8 decoder using 2 is to 4 decoders, we make use of 2 2 is to 4 decoders because we have 3 inputs for a 3 is to 8 decoder and 8 output lines. In this particular case, I will choose the active high output. So that is why you can see that Y0 to Y7 corresponds to logic 1 output case which is being highlighted in yellow. For the 2 is to 4 decoders I will use the LSB variables B and C and the MSB variable will be provided to the enable pin as A bar for the first 2 is to 4 deco decoder and as A for the second 2 is to 4 decoder. So hence we can obtain all the 8 output lines in a similar manner like the one which we obtain for the 3 is to 8 decoder. So you can see that whatever output variables are obtained using the 2 2 is to 4 decoders are similar to the one obtained using 3 is to 8 decoder.
for the construction of 4 is to 16 decoder we place 5 2 is to 4 decoders and we are going to mark the decimal notations for each of the decoders since we have 4 is to 16 decoder that means that we require 4 input variables and we will name them as a b c d I will consider a and b the msb variables to be placed at the first decoder the LSB variable C and D will be for the other four decoders. So from the first decoder with the input variables A and B, I obtain the combinations 00, 01, 10 and 11 which will be useful to implement the 4 is to 16 decoder. and the outputs of the first decoder will be given to the enable pins and this enable pin is considered to be high that is equal to 1 from this particular example what we understand is that decoders with the enable inputs can be used to construct larger sized decoders so here is another question which says we need to develop a logic diagram of 2 is to 4 decoder with the specifications given. The first specification is active low enable input and second one is active high encoded output. So I am going to place the 2 is to 4 decoder and I require the enable pin the enable pin specified is supposed to be active low so that is why I am going to bubble the enable pin just to indicate that it is an active low input and at the output I am considering Y0, Y1, Y2, Y3 and inputs to be A and B I will draw the truth table for this particular 2 is to 4 decoder wherein I consider that if the enable input is high that is logic 1 irrespective of the type of the input that is given the output is going to be 0 whereas if the enable pin is 0 depending upon the input that you provide you are going to get an active high encoded output and finally because it is mentioned in the question to draw the logic diagram I am going to draw the logic diagram with the NOT gate and the AND gate by looking at the expressions for the output variables obtained from the 2 is to 4 decoder.